Welcome back to another Premier League predictions video. This is for week 20 of the Premier League and we are officially into the second half of the season. Naturally, some games have been postponed. They just haven't been included in this video. First game up is Watford and West Ham. This is a massive game for both sides. A must win game. For Watford, they haven't played the last couple of games because of COVID. So they'll be fresh for this game. However, saying that, they've lost six of the last seven games. So they're in shocking form. And for West Ham, they lost their last game to Southampton, conceding three goals. So not a great result. And they have now lost four of their last six games. So they're also in awful form. Both teams are low in confidence. They're struggling to win games. This will be a tough one. Either side could win it. I think it'll be a 2-2 draw. Next game up is Crystal Palace and Norwich. This is another massive game for both sides. For Norwich, this is a chance for them to pick up maximum points and try and stay up in the fight for relegation. And for Palace, they've been in poor form recently. I think they've won only once in their last seven games, which is pretty shocking stuff. It's not really acceptable, but in this game, they have a chance to rectify that. This will be a tough game. Either side could win it. I think it'll be a 1-1 draw. Next game up is Southampton and Tottenham. This is a big game for both sides. For Southampton, they did well to win away at West Ham, scoring three goals, which is quite impressive considering Southampton Southampton aren't a team that are notorious for scoring goals. Goals? Oh my god. So well done. And for Tottenham, they're going along nicely. They're winning quite a lot of games, which isn't something I was expecting, even though they did have a change in manager. In Antonio Conte so you know well done to them they're scoring goals they're looking good and I think this will be a 3-1 win to Tottenham next game up is Leicester and Liverpool this will be a 4-1 win to Liverpool next game up is Chelsea and Brighton this will be a tough game for both sides Either side could win it. Chelsea did win their last game against Aston Villa. Although they did make hard work of it. And for Brighton, they won their last game against Brentford. And they finally got a win because before that game, they hadn't won a league game since September. So that is pretty shocking stuff. Although in between, they did have a lot of draws. So... They weren't exactly losing games, but they weren't winning any either. So maybe in the second half of the season, they can rectify that. Once again, this will be a tough game. Either side could win it. I think it'll be a 2-1 win to Chelsea. Next game up is Brentford and Man City. This will be a 3-0 win to Man City. Next game up is Everton and Newcastle. This is a massive game for both sides. No doubt both sides are in a relegation battle. For Everton, they've had quite a few injuries this season, which has really wrecked or destroyed their season. I'll say, I'll say wrecked. Destroyed is a bit strong, but it's kind of derailed their season. Excuse me. And for Newcastle, you know, obviously 
They were in a relegation battle. They did manage to get a point in their last game against Manchester United, which might be helpful in the long run. But they are really struggling. Both teams are low in confidence, so this game could go either way. But I think it'll be a surprise 2-0 win to Newcastle. And the last game for the week is May United and Burnley. This is a big game for both sides. I think either side could win it. Manchester United failed to beat Newcastle in the last game, which was surprising because I thought they would have won that comfortably, but they didn't. They even ended up going behind in that game. And for Burnley, they've had quite a few games postponed now. I think we're up to three. So they've got quite a few games they need to catch up on. Um, and they are another team that will be quite fresh for this game. They'll be ready for it. This will be a tough game. Either side could win it. I think it'll be a nil-nil draw. And that's about it.